everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I've got a small part of my shoe collection to show you. They are my office heels. Now, I work in an office business environment where I can wear heels every day if I wanted to and I can also wear flats. I do tend to wear a suit to work and heels are just a nice way to add a little bit of personality. So, I hope you enjoy, sit back and relax. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up down below, subscribe and leave me a comment. So straight into my first part of the collection, these are my black heels. These are from Dorothy Perkins, they are a patent leather court shoe, quite high and to be honest with you, some of the most uncomfortable shoes that I wear. So I don't wear them too often. There is a platform to help compensate for the height of the heel, but they're just not that comfortable. Okay, so my second pair of black heels, these are in Marks and Spencer's court shoe. They've got quite a nice almond toe, not quite a point, not quite a round, and these are so comfy. They've got an insolia heel, which is what I love about Marks and Spencer's because all of their shoes are really comfortable, and the heel isn't even that low. The next pair of black shoes, also from Marks and Spencer's, these don't have the cushiony heel in, but look at them, they are gorgeous. These, to be honest, I call them my James Bond shoes because if I was a Bond girl, these are the heels that I would wear. They've got three straps, so you've got lots of comfort. They keep your foot in throughout the whole day. And my next pair of black heels, these are actually a new buy that I've just bought myself and treated myself to. These are from Steve Madden and they're a matte leather block heel but pointed toe shoe. Now these, when you feel the leather, is just gorgeous and I think they'll be my new favourite blacks. Ooh, just look at them. If I can find the link for these, because I did buy them really recently, then I will link them down below along with any other of these shoes in the collection that I can find. Now these next pair, these are from Marks & Spencers. They're a really soft blush leather court shoe. Again, I can wear these all day long because they are so, so comfortable. They really do mould to your foot throughout the day, which I find great and really adds to the comfort. Next up, we have a pair from Next. Now these, although quite high, they do have a high platform so they don't feel like you walk in on a really, really high shoe. The block court heel again adds to the comfort and the strap makes sure that your foot just stays in them really nice and comfortably for the whole day. Now these I actually love so much that I bought the exact same pair in black, but I keep those under my desk in case of emergencies when I'm in the office. Next up, we have quite a low pair of heels actually for me, but these are great because they feel like I'm walking on flats. They're from Marks and & Spencers and they're a dog tooth fabric with a pointed toe. They're brown and black and they are so comfortable that I can wear these all day long. And if I'm going out for a meal straight after work, I don't have to worry about my feet hurting. Now next up are probably some of my most fun pair of shoes. These, again from Marks & Spencers, are a blue suede heel. They've again got a pointed toe they're not very high, so I can wear them all day. And they're great with an all black suit or a pair of black crop trousers or a black pencil skirt. I've actually worn these out for dinner in the evening with a lovely black leather skirt and they look great. They just add a bit of colour to any outfit. Next up, we enter into my snakeskin collection and I got a little bit obsessed one summer and bought a couple of pairs of shoes. Now these I love because they are yellow on the back and snake print on the front. They are really comfortable, again quite low, but the strap across the front is fantastic. To my second pair of snake print shoes, these are quite high and not for the faint hearted. They're a pointed court, quite a thin heel and they're from New Look. Now these I've got to be honest, I tend to only wear when I know that I'm going to be in meetings all day or sat at my desk and I'm not having to walk up and down stairs or to and from the office. Now these are KG by Kurt Geiger, my third and final pair of snakeskin print heels. 
Now they've got a bit of a sting back and they are my power. I am here to conquer the world kind of vibe to them. And I really do love them. Now next up are a bit unusual to wear to the office. They're from John Lewis and they do have a gold glittery main body to the shoe. They've got the black suede front and the black suede heel, which kind of keeps them corporate. But because of the gold glitter, they are really, really fun to wear, especially with the season such as Christmas coming up. And my final shoe. Now these are Carvella by Kurt Geiger and they're a patent nude leather. Now, you may be able to tell as I spin that they are slightly too big for me. And I don't know if anyone else has this, but in the summer, my shoes get too small. And in the winter, they're too big because my feet shrink. So what I really need to do with these is buy myself a pair of shoe inserts so that I can keep on wearing them through the colder seasons. Watching my office heel video. If there are any other parts of my shoe collection that you want to watch, then leave a comment down below and I'll be sure to put that video together for you. As I said previously, if I can find any of the shoes online, I will leave them down below as well. So have a gander down there, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.